this is our nursing fundamentals program. So this is the completer course for the CET track for health science. So what they are trying to do is they are getting all the skills and all the knowledge ready to take their state NA exam to go on to bigger and better things. So this is a normal one, this is a Gallup. So I try to always be honest with them and tell them what the real world of healthcare is. I want them to be aware of all of what they're going to be doing in the real world. The nice thing about this class is that we have the skills, so it's easy to connect the theory to the skills. There's always a way to connect it back to the real world so they understand why it's important. I feel like this program has given me a good amount of experience like dipping my toes into the water of the medical field. They tell you yes, how long are you going to wait? Probably. 15 minutes and then come back. It's so exciting because for me personally, I want to enter nursing and so this is a great building block to get there because I can gain experience and clinical hours that will give me a step up to nursing school and then I'll be able to be a step ahead of step ahead of everyone else. It's really, really exciting to have this kind of um, experience under your belt going into like a higher education just because, I don't know, it's a nice comfort to like be a little bit ahead of the game, you know? I think it's a super awesome opportunity because it lets these kids explore this um, profession before they get to college. So you can figure out if you like it or not. And if you don't, you don't have to waste your time in college. And then if you do like it, you get to already invest yourself in it and already learn these skills and these topics before you even get to college. So you can get a better understanding of it before you get to the healthcare field. What's it supposed to sound like? Buh, buh. We've learned a lot of like, I don't know, I want to say coping skills. <laughs> just in a sense of like, this is what you're going to encounter and it's gonna be really uncomfortable. And so like hearing how to deal with those things and like what to do and how to make other people comfortable in the worst moments of their lives is such an important, really cool thing to learn. It's been really interesting to get that kind of preparedness for the field. I don't know, I'm definitely set on nursing now <laughs> just because hearing about the way that you deal with people on such an important, like caring, empathetic level is kind of what I was always looking for, and that really confirmed it. It goes straight back in your ears this way. It's like invaluable because now we can go apply for jobs in hospitals or nursing homes or other medical fields, um, and we, so we can enter the healthcare field now. It's a lot of work, but it's super, super worth it to be that kind of prepared for college and for the workforce. Or they have to sleep with their bed completely elevated. I'm trying to train them to be CNAs that I would want to work with in the hospital, not just someone to pass their test. They love this program. They love what it has to offer them and what they get from it in general. This gives them the foundation for anything they want to do in healthcare. And even if they choose not to go into something in healthcare, this gives them a foundation to be able to have communication skills, to have professional skills, to be able to accomplish something that there's adults that haven't yet accomplished. You did great. I think this is even more relevant today than it has been in the past just because we do have a healthcare shortage, especially with nurses. But these kids are really and truly the future of healthcare that are coming up, that are going to be able to make changes, that are going to be fantastic nurses, physicians, physician's assistants, physical therapists, or occupational therapists. That does not sound normal. You're exactly right. I think that is the coolest thing is that any kid that has an interest in healthcare has the ability to do this and to get their CNA. There are districts that are not going to have this and the fact that our district believes enough in this program that we can have it is amazing to me.